Okay, so it's week 18 of our container gardening experiment. And I think we're sort of at a crossroads here. Uh, because on the one hand, we have several things that do not seem to be doing very well. For example, bean plants that were once producing but are no longer. Well, they're still producing, but the beans they produce that I picked this week um, are had, kind of dubious. Had red spots on them. And the plant seems to be dying now. Yeah. And our pumpkin plant, which... Oh, here we go. Hold on a sec. Me... What's that there? Is that a this bean? Is, this is a bean. Hmm, dubious. Yeah, and it, the plant's kind of dying now. Yeah. So, and, the, and our pumpkin plant, too, which has never produced anything, of course. Well, it's looking somewhat has, dubious, too. There's still new leaves growing and everything, but the powdery mildew gets to them kind of fast, and then they... Yeah. Uh, and our cucumber plants here are really not looking too hot, either. One is had completely died, and I pulled it, and I think I'm going to have to pull this one soon. However, on the other hand... <laughs> We've got tomatoes galore, which some might say is a fair trade-off. Uh, we've got just a whole lot of tomatoes that are starting to ripen up kind of all at once, which is really kind of cool to see. All these tomatoes everywhere. And there seems to have been ripe tomatoes like every single day this week. Yeah, so it's been really wonderful. Well, and it's... Well, I was going to say, and as you can see, we've got a whole lot more flowers. And we learned, Tiffany, have we ever talked about the shaking trick? Yeah. We have. The idea is you're supposed to shake them, shake the flowers sort of vigorously, because that helps to pollinate them if the wind doesn't do it. Although we get a lot of wind, so it may just be useless. Now, what were you going to say? What was the all, though? Well, I'm worried we about up here. the two plants down here, because I haven't been able to figure out what's wrong with them. The because their leaves. Their leaves don't look like any of the pictures that I've seen, but I don't know if this has to do with me, if it has to do with me not watering them consistently or something, but, um, because some of them are, like, turning, like, brown and, like, dying, and then I kind of cut them off, but I don't know what, what it is that's causing that. It's kind of hard to say. If we have a disease or what. I don't know. But it seems like, for sure, these tomatoes may just be the biggest producer of our season. <laughs> no problem. Yeah. We do have more, cu we have more cucumbers growing. That's, that's good. And we also have uh, our peppers. I think we showed this last week. It looks like they almost want to bloom, which would be awesome if they actually can. Although, it's questionable. Yeah whether or not they, they actually are. So that's sort of week, uh, what is it, 18? Yeah. So that's week 18. Um, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you next weekend.